I came from Bendigo and I had to move to uh, Melbourne for work because our business had grown down there and I didn't want to bring up my kids in the city so I looked at other areas to live and uh, Geelong became the obvious choice. I think there's a common bond that brings everyone together and it just makes it very easy to, to communicate with people and to bring people together and you know, I just really love the feeling of Geelong. Yeah, I moved to Geelong at the end of 2009, originally from Perth, and to go up here now, uh, to call it home. There's so much community involvement amongst the whole town, and uh, especially being a part of the Cats, you're able to embrace so many different people, it's awesome. You meet a, a range of, of businesses that um, you know want to be a part of the Cats. We have great values that I think align with a lot of those businesses, especially Villawood. So we've got a real community event, we love supporting local communities. And I think the Cats, particularly through their Cats Foundation and the way the players go out to the, into the um, local communities, represent themselves and interact with kids, etc., just gives us both a, a, common, um, a common goal. Connecting with uh, so many different uh, groups in the community, giving back to the community, they obviously do a lot for us um, in supporting, supporting the team and the town, so I think it's really important. When Villa starts a new community, we like to support the community groups around us, a range of um, groups where they're smaller sporting clubs, Charity groups, life-saving clubs, care workers, nurses, teachers, police, emergency services, anybody actually cares, carers themselves. There's a whole range of charities that we do support and I think it's really important for us to interact and engage with those, with those people and make them part of our community. We're sitting here in the Players' Garden, um, the club came to me for a little bit of support for when they built the new stand and very happy to take on the Players' Garden because we can put a bit of our, our flavour in here and um, one of the big highlights is the down the back with the rotunda, the, the, a lot of the wives and the kids can come down and play around. After the game, a lot of you see a lot of the kids running around and a lot of the boys do like shooting the hoops in uh, their spare time. Jermaine Jones is uh, a regular out here, so is Gary Ablett. It's obviously got great light, um, you know, so it brings you into the, the players' lounge as well, so it's yeah, set up really well. Rory, why I've got you here, mate. We've got a jumper, uh, 30 years of Villawood properties, so, mate, you're, you're ticking all the boxes there and looking after the community. Well Very done, thoughtful. Mate. Thanks, Mitch. Yeah. <laughs>